Good afternoon and welcome to Sport North West. I'm Liam Senior. And I'm Lewis Muir. Coming up on today's show, we preview the weekend's fixtures, we have an interview with Sky Sports' Eddie Hemmings, and we look ahead to the start of the County Championship cricket season, which kicks off on Sunday. But first, Burnley's push for promotion heads down south as they take on Watford tomorrow. The Clarets will be looking to bounce back from last weekend's 2-0 defeat against Leicester. Ben Redioff reports. Yeah, I think you can see that by now the, the English team, you know, at the top of it all is, uh, you know, struggled over the last few years. So, um, but, you know, there seems to be more and more things in place now. So I'm trying to improve, you know, young coaches, uh, the development of our young players. And thankfully, you know, when you look at some of the, the players in the Premiership now, um, who are doing well, holding their own position. You know, they're coming through the likes of Ross Barkley, Sterling at Liverpool. You know, good players that are getting a chance at Premiership level, and that's keys. So the game can improve. I think that the standards just risen. You know what I mean? The standards risen, um, but it's, it's, it's had a positive, positive effect. Better playing for three points every week rather than just training for nothing, and it gives you that edge over, like, to go into games, and you just get excited about playing every week. And it obviously the experience of it, obviously to improve, make you a better player. What was pre-season like in Dubai? We had a lovely time in, in Dubai, it was great to get out there. Um, now the sponsorship by Emirates, they flew us out there and we had a good little, it was good, some good cricket we played in the 2020 tournament which was fabulous. Um, two day game against Sussex, also good and a couple of one days. So nice to get some sun on our, on our backs and playing English, we used English wickets out there at Sport City which was great um, and it was fabulous pre uh, preparation for the season. After a KG opening start, the physicality of the fixture was there to see. It wasn't until the 15th minute when the deadlock was broken. Prop forward Nick Zalad started and finished the move. Another Zalad try meant Uclan went into the break 12-0 up. Zalad completed his hat-trick just after half-time after powering through the Lancaster defence. Good work from the forwards allowed the ball to be spread out wide. Sam Waiting fed the ball to win Jack Ellis and crossed over. You wouldn't think firefighting and boxing would have so many similarities but they both take courage, determination and hard work. Adding to the fact Sus member is a hero and a professional boxer, he also spends his time mentoring and guiding young locals away from crime and off street corners. When I was younger, I had quite a bit of a colourful past. I got, you know, mixed in with the wrong crowd. And I'd, I'd never go and, and start saying, well, I had, a bad, I, did, I had the best upbringing possible. I had brilliant parents, um, they gave me everything I wanted, it was me, I was weak willed, I got in with the wrong crowd and trying to prove myself and getting into silly fights, getting beat up, beating people up and just doing you know, petty crime and going to school and because of that I realised that um, you can always change and I think I'm trying to portray that in my mentoring programmes and the stuff I do with uh, youths through prisons, schools, uh, youth clubs and things like that just to say to them look, no matter what lot you've got you can always change. The youngsters that are coming on loan from big clubs, do you find yourself as a role experienced role models and do they come and speak to you for advice? Yeah, they come to speak to me for advice but you know like I say they're footballer like me, you know. If they have to learn about me, you know, yes, but if not I'm, I'm happy to, 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 to show them the way, you know, how to manage a game and to do it to approach a game and you know and to be concentrated on the pitch and do the job. His bout against Sepang Mahale in South Africa, for example. But best career moment so far. You know, every man and his dog told us not to go over. You know, everybody was saying, don't go over, you'll get ironed out. You know, they're putting him to slaughter. He's, he'd had nine, one nine, knocked eight out. You know, all this. I've heard it all before. You know, Johnny's always, you know, Johnny always said, I've seen, I've seen enough of what you do. I've seen enough of what he does. You know, what, what you do, good. Will Preston's Matty Clarkson become victorious and claim the English title? Only time will tell. But one thing that is for sure is a bright future for Northwest Boxing. Liam Senior, Sport Northwest.